They like the drama, though. People get entertained from all that. Well, I'm telling you right now, man, you know, we getting kind of fed up with it. He even got, I I, I seen Vlad, he got a little upset about um, um, uh, Shannon Sharp. When Shannon Sharp had Cat Williams and that shit went through the roof, Vlad started talking crazy about that interview. He was upset. Yeah. Because he didn't. didn't, Yeah, he didn't. Because of the numbers. Because. Uh, Chad Sharp said he made him. so much money yeah. off of it. He said he didn't make that much money. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. So I'm just telling you, this is what they're doing. Am I tripping on them? No, I'm just stating the facts. I, I can't say it. That's what it is. It yeah. is what it is. Yeah. Everybody can see it, but nobody everybody see it. it. Nobody's saying that. So I'm just saying, what is he? What is he trying to? What is, what is the end game? How is he trying to help? Is he in the community giving away bikes? Is he? Have he ever did like me being oh, yeah. here 18 years and, 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 and giving? So. No, I'm just saying giving away uh, to like we did giving away mothers back. You know uh, when it's back to school tax free yeah, weekend no. giving away <laughs> clothes to our single blacks. Yeah, that's what we that did over here. Case, that's what we'd be talking about. <laughs> no, we talking about uh, somebody got locked up after they left the show. Mm-hmm. They like I mean, the drama though. People get entertained from all that. Well, I'm telling you right now, man, you know, we getting kind of fed up with it. He even got, I I, I seen Vlad, he got a little upset about um, um, uh, Shannon Sharp. When Shannon Sharp had Cat Williams and that shit went through the roof, Vlad started talking crazy about that interview. He was upset. Yeah. Because he didn't. didn't, Yeah, he didn't. Because of the numbers. Because Shannon Sharp said he made so much money off of it. He said he didn't make that much money. He kept going in on him about the money that he said that they were saying he made and how much it was. And that was like, he felt like he's the gatekeeper of, of YouTube and how he going to be better than me. So it's crazy when you get so self-righteous that you think you control the black culture. Yeah, well, that's ignorant. <laughs> I'm just being real. Just to, yeah, yeah. So I don't know. But he's showing it. Yeah, he is like, he not? He because who's watching it? But he pays. He pays good too. Boosie might be getting thirty thousand a a, a a a damn interview. And that's why people are doing it for him. Yeah, he pay everybody exactly. So of he give them three thousand. Everybody's in it for the money, right? Right. Four thousand. He give them. So it's not like they're doing it for free. So I mean. Yeah, but still, it's a thing where it, it looks a certain way when you start looking it at is? the top tier leadership, looking at what's going on, right. or if somebody tell Vlad no. Like Tyrese told Vlad he ain't going on his show. Right. He got upset about it, started exploiting him, said, when I say exploiting it, I heard him say, you know, man, he asked Boosie about it. That's how he thought. Hey, Boosie, how about you? What you think about Tyrese? And and I tried to get him to come on my show, and he didn't even do it. And then he going to post something about my show. You see what I'm saying? This is the kind of stuff that's happening. It was somebody else, too. It was was one more person that wouldn't go on there. Like, I ain't going on that nigga's show, and... Blah blah blah, and every time he'll come and ask some one of the other black people, okay, kind of you see what I'm saying? Yeah, Why he didn't? Yeah, but you trying that's pinning yeah, us so against. We had, we had uh, Pimpin Ken on here, who Pimpin Ken, that's my boy, and we talked about Pimp C sex tape, and he took what we talked about and put it on the show in his show and said, "Hey, you heard that story about uh." This is what Vlad asked Boosie. Hey, you heard that story about that Pimp C sex tape? And he didn't say, Pimp and Kim was on some, you know, show. He didn't say boss talk. He didn't give an acknowledgement or nothing. Oh. He basically just kind of took our information yeah. uh-huh. and, and, and then made something out of it. Yeah. But, and that's cool. I get it. But Pimp and Kim came on here. He was mad as hell about that. If it's a problem, let me know. But I'm just saying, you know, I would have never, I ain't never addressed this issue until he asked Boosie. He opened mm-hmm. a can of wine. Yeah, he did. If he would have never asked Boosie, you know, he like it almost like I was lying. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah. all I said, you know, Vlad, talk to me. Talk to me, you know what I mean? Come to me, ask me some shit. Don't ask no Boosie shit. If you want to be in this street shit, you want to fuck with black folks, you want to fuck with black culture, then you got to know how this culture go. We don't do that type of shit. You don't ask no another mother about another mm-hmm. mother. You come to that nigga, you ask that nigga, hey man, what's up? Otherwise, you, you, you're discounting me and you're making me look like I'm not real. And, and any motherfucker know, they know Pimp C was my best friend. I ain't gonna be up here lying. And like I said, I'm on the show where this shit happened. Yeah, and you, yeah, you should know that, you know what I'm saying, we ain't bullshit. You know what I'm saying, his wife is here out here. It wasn't me meant to come out, it just came out. 
That's the, the way it go. And, and, like, and, and if, he, if he's a real journalist, which he is, he should be able to read between the lines. That's right. <laughs> yeah. He was like, man, why would you come over here talking about what I said on another mother? You can call me. Right. I've been on your show before. Why would you? And he was upset about yeah. that. So what I'm telling you is, it is this, this game is competitive as hell. That's why people don't mention people's name. They don't mention people. They don't want to. I talk about everybody. I'll say, if I want to say real life, I say real. I want to say, say cheese, I say, say cheese. No jumper, Vlad, whoever. I don't care because I'm who I am. But they're doing that because they feel like they, you know, boxing you out or they don't mention your name they they can keep you from growing dl hugley did a whole damn set on my show and didn't even say boss talk i was mad as hell Aww. a little bit yeah. but that's because i'm a fan of his i like him so he didn't say the show now i'm like what the yeah, hell made you feel some what type you mean of way, like he was he was no. on his radio show his and he radio. talked oh, about what show. i okay. done on my show for an hour and didn't even say boss talk 101 and where it came from, yeah. Or what a video. Wow. He just talked about Gip and 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 two and uh, P Diddy, and he defended uh, P Diddy. And at the end of the day, Gip was saying something he said, but he say on this he got it off this other show. It was my show. Yeah, that's my stuff. So it's stuff like that that's going on where I don't think people they feel like they're doing you a favor, but don't don't talk about nothing on my show if you don't want to you don't want to mention my show. Yeah, but that's because. But shout out to Breakfast Club. I got to shout out Just Hilarious. Thank you, baby, <laughs> for, for putting me up. Fifty Cent her. for posting my show. Just you know, all the other people. It's a lot of them from academics, DJ academics, dope. Post my show when it comes to posting. These niggas, they rock with me. Uh, I can't say it. World Star, all of them. Yeah. Everybody that really rock with the Shade Room. I, I can keep naming them. Vlad has yeah. shared your stuff. Vlad has shared my stuff a lot. I ain't gonna lie. I be really tripping off that because I be like, damn, Vlad still be sharing my stuff. But He I might not be... call your name out, but he share your content. But it's hard not to when that shit going viral like crazy. <laughs> everybody else sharing it. Right. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yep. That makes everybody else want to share it too. So, but I definitely respect and like the fact that he. But you can't even say that because you you you're the one who would say that. Well, podcasts and certain people in Dallas don't share it. Yeah, but that's different. You know, that's the local stuff. I get that. I, I but it's just when it go viral, viral. You know, you want to see everybody get a jab at it. Shout out to Miami. Shout out to Africa. Shout out to all the people that rock with us. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That keep sharing the content and rocking out with us anyway. You know what I'm saying? And shout out to Money Moses, who we know Star can tell. Starships and Rockets. Uh, Money Moses is uh, uh, ex is on the show. Or are y'all still together? <laughs> we was never in a relationship. Y'all was never in a relationship. I'm just trying to figure out what went down. <laughs> Oh this boss talk. God. <laughs> he on the wall right there. I said he, he locked up. He in prison. But at the end of the day, uh, we got to say free money Moses. Free money Moses, y'all. Oh. Free money oh, Moses. Free money Moses. <laughs> <laughs> you looking at the relationship. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> No, no. Uh, that, I mean that's 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 my boy. Like really, that's my boy. He definitely had my back in you know a little situation. I needed a friend, and he was there for me. So yeah, you know, well that's I, my I, that's my nigga. If he don't get no bigger, if he get bigger, he gonna be my bigger nigga. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That nigga is that's that's boss talk. Yeah. So at the end of the day, uh, without him, you would you wouldn't be sitting in that seat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Think about that for a minute. No, because that was his. They argued with. I had him in L.A. just recently. <laughs> he called her and got went off on on her birthday. So I knew who she was because of that. Then he tried to show me a picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at her. She's on. I don't give a damn about that bra, nigga. <laughs> but that's my boy, though. You know what I'm saying? So I'm riding with him anyway. It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? And then how many times you was like, "Hey, I need you to come out here." Yeah, so you ain't never do nothing. I'm here now. Yeah, it took you a whole damn year. It wasn't a year. It seemed like it. Six months. Five. <laughs> <laughs> Better late than Half never. Half of a year. Already. <laughs> yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.